Today we are listening to Caress Your Soul by Sticky Fingers. This was a requested album. I've never heard any song from them. I don't even know what genre this is, but I just wanted to really listen to this album for my Patreon supporters and everybody else that's watching, of course. Before we get into strictly 2024 albums, finishing off some discographies that we have from some of the artists that I've been listening to. Radiohead, The Strokes, Ariana Grande, JPEG Mafia, oh, Childish Gambino, Linkin Park, and plenty of all of them you can see in the playlist below in my album reactions review so i'm really excited to do those two things so i said before that let's actually just close out on some of the albums that were requested and this is one of them caress your soul sticky fingers like i said this is a brand new first time listen let's hope that i really enjoy this album rock out with me fam let's get it going if you want to see the full uncut reaction then click the patreon link below and tap in i appreciate y'all subscribe to the youtube because i'm dropping so many albums i love this shit I'm really, really loving learning new music, so let's get right into it. How to Fly. I take the bright soul. first introduction i still don't know which genre this is but i could definitely see like i was imagining myself sipping on pina colada at a beach resort and that's just playing and i would absolutely love it it'll probably get stuck in my in my mind like oh i forget my name forget my name however you sang it was beautiful like i said the perfect word that i could say is just funky like that's just a real just a cool funky song great start clouds and cream speaking of cream i'm getting some dipping dots in a little bit that's for damn sure. There's a new spot that opened up next to my crib, and I'm like, this is heaven on earth. Thank you. A song up here I really love.
was cool. I like the first track more, but that was cool. I have a feeling though, the way that they putting these songs together, I feel like there's gonna be a song or two that makes me really fall in love with it. I'll be shocked if that didn't happen. It was a real sunny day. We were chilling in the land of the camper down park. Nobody had a frown. Reminiscing on the days where we used to have a blaze. Everybody came around and we laxed out on the lays. I don't remember when we drink and we smoke and we talk and we laugh. And a night would just go on and on. from Australia. That's Dylan Frost singing. Patty Cornwall. Oh, this is good. They got the guitar going crazy in this song, the drums going crazy. I love that song, fam. Australia Street. They from Aussie. That's so dope. And you know what? Shout out to all the Australian supporters that I have. Like, I know that's a crazy thing to say because it's a whole continent. But the reason why I said Australia supporters, because I don't know specifically where y'all from. But every single time that I hop on the gram, I was checking like certain DMs, certain messages. It would always be like, love from Australia. And I'm like, no fucking way. That is crazy, you guys. I'm over here in Connecticut, America. <laughs> so it's wild to see all that. And I just want to say I appreciate y'all so much. That's such a great song. And I could hear the influence. They said that really this is like, a psycho rock and roll when you're feeling low and when you're getting high and everything in between and i love that great song i like that song a lot actually wow their first song was the most popular wow when i'm lying in a room i'll be thinking about you 200 million i'll be thinking about you babe i'll be thinking about you babe even when she smiles i'll be thinking about you Ooh. i'll be thinking about you baby hold up i'll be thinking about you baby even when i look discreetly down into her eyes you know i'm thinking about that time i spent between your thighs even then i wandered deeply through your glances this girl will never care
you could play this album and just have a good time. That's something you don't want to admit, but these things do happen. You're thinking about somebody else while you're with somebody else, it's like, man. When I'm lying in a room, I'll be thinking about you. I'll be thinking about you, babe. I'll be thinking about you, babe. When you're with that other guy, I hope you're thinking about me. I hope you're thinking about me, babe. Cause I'm thinking about you Oh, 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 perfect ending to that song. That little switch is exactly what I wanted. I think I'm gonna save this one, the first song, in Australia Street. But this one definitely really hit like on a emotional, personal level. Like that switch at the end. When you're with that other guy, I hope you're thinking about me, babe, cause I'm thinking about you. That's what every person really hopes. When you have thoughts, like last night I had a crazy dream. I can't lie. And it's in that dream made me think to myself, I was thinking about it actually like 30 minutes ago. I wonder if they had a dream too about that. You know what I'm saying? That's what you hope for. You hope that you're never the only one. Such a relatable song. Having sex, there's no reason at all. In life, place your best, take it easy. a smooth track right there is this a classic album i keep running down the same road and the people keep on coming down because it's funny this the way that that guitar is i usually don't like that type of music to be honest like it's even still right now me listening to this i'm like ah really it's just not for me what's the word for that like the type of style that is i don't like it but I can see where even the individuals that really, well, for the individuals that really love this music, this got to be like a classic album for y'all. If you love that style of guitaring, the way that he's playing it and whatever, the way that they're singing, anything like that, golden for y'all. And all the burn bridges, could everybody would have put it back together again. Goddamn. I keep falling down the same stairs to a city with an integrity plan to brainwash on my ears. I'm free he's rapping sometimes. I'm not clinically inside, but I am tormented. Couldn't bother when to put it back together again. We keep floating Whoa, around the same club. ideas, and I won't be getting started to find out wasn't here. Free falling through this ice show. You can dance this. guitar and that piano get some love. Where are that? Mm. I face these voices. I keep my choices. These power noises. I face these voices. These power noises. This is like jazz now. I face these voices. I keep my choices. 
went from the beach resort to the late night jazz bar. The title track, Caress Your Soul. Let's see. The last two tracks ain't my favorite, but they cool. You know, Bootleg, Rascal, and Caress Your Soul are both good once again. It's crazy because, like I said, the formula is just going to hit for them every time. This sound different, see? Hold up. Struggling with breathing Suffocates my brain And there's nowhere Gravity's away. I am the one away though they sent me in a spy Hold up, this sound different, this is a good atmosphere Gazing out the space screen Memories below Tone of voice, I really love it. that different storytelling right there for this dog he's talking about who's he talking to that's why i have to listen to this again see master why do you have to leave me 
They didn't have to deceive me. We were friends. It's kind of like a dog talking to their owner. Master, why would, why do you have to leave me? I'm the runaway dog. They sent me into space. It's a little planet flying through the stars. I don't want to sit down. What really hit me was like the third verse, I believe it, when it said, and I'm lonely taking in the moonlight. Was it worth it? Worth it breaking trust? Worth the weight of love? We have now lost. We were friends. Such a different song. Lyrically, never heard anything like this. But you can put it, that story, this song, into anything in your life that you could just, it's personal. You can feel it automatically and be like, man, I remember this situation. I remember this feeling. Such a beautiful song. It might be my favorite, if not one of the favorites up here so far. Let me know, fam. Do y'all love this song too? Because this song really was good. Freddie Krabs. Also, the cover art is insane. I love it though. It's its own thing. Instantly you see that, you know what the album is and you just knew it was gonna be everywhere. I knew it was gonna be abstract, I love it. I'm okay with this intro being after that past song. It, it really did carry on the feeling. He know how to play that shit. That was a smooth track. That was just a cool track once again. Felt like we were just near the water or something. Just letting it ride out. I do like the fact that they have so many different sounds within this album. Like you don't know what the next song is gonna sound like or what it's gonna be, and that keeps it fresh. I really like that actually. I hit the bay, running the mark and I don't stop. I've been living the same day for the past six months. The vocals sound different too sometimes. Because I'm doing what I love, and I won't leave the stage until you motherfuckers show. I leave my pride inside oblivion. Don't take yourself so serious. Life is just a game, so you can share all your fears without this peace within. Harmony that flows within the core of me Grows up in my mind And falls out of an undesirable tree So have a laugh Or get blasted out to space <laughs> They look like a space Just 
Kiss the breeze and let your rhythm flow out. Just kiss the breeze and let your rhythm flow out. That's exactly the epitome of this album. Just kiss the breeze and let your rhythm flow out. You're in a breeze. Kiss the breeze, cause you know it's a lovey dovey songs too up in here. Let your rhythm flow out. Just dance, have a good time on this beach with the breeze, with the water. That's exactly how I feel about this album. And I love his rapping at the end too. Just I feel at the West Coast. I'm like, it made me feel like I was listening to hip hop shit real quick. Last song of the album, let it all out. There you go. I'ma let it all out. I don't even care. Okay. Like we're at a country bar right here. the music on this album. Sticky fingers. Caress your soul. I like that ending. I like that. That right there, fam, was Caress Your Soul by Sticky Fingers. And honestly, this is an album that I would listen to again. I've been doing a lot of albums that sometimes I'm like, when would I ever hear this again? Or why would I want to hear it again when I'm not editing it? You know, when it's already uploaded on YouTube, am I going to listen to it again? And I have some albums that I definitely do. I definitely listen to all the time, of course. But there's some that I'm like, I've done. And even if I do like them, first time listen, while I edit, whatever, I'm like, I never really went back to those albums. This is an album that I definitely can see where I might just let it play on my next resort vacation. Like, no cat. I could just automatically already hear it going on. And like they said, the breeze and just letting it flow and just vibe throughout everything. Like they said, when you're at your lowest, you could put it on and it could raise you up and make you just happier. Uh, when you're high, you could put it on because you're already high. You just already got the beat, flow, the vibe, everything like that that just already kind of seems like that. It, uh, Reminded me of Venice Beach in California. Least favorite songs, I guess I kind of, in between Freddy Krabs and Kill the Breeze, Let It Out, a good ending that are not some of my favorites. Just like Bootleg, Rascal, and Caress Your Soul are not some of my favorites. Clouds and Cream, same. But How to Fly, Australia Street, These Girls, even a little bit of sex. Leica, my four favorite songs on the album. And I'll definitely let you guys know in the description below after I edit and re-listen if that changed. But I feel like that's, hell yeah, th those four are amazing. And let me know, fam, is this Sticky Fingers' best album? Definitely let me know. The style, like I said, with the guitar stuff is a little different for me. Isn't some of my favorite. So with that being said, I'm really happy that I listened to this album today. It gave me a better vibe. It, it's making me want to skip down the street and feel just so much better. Um, and I can't wait to edit it and re-listen to it again. I'll probably eat some ice cream while I'm listening to it and just be in a good space. So thank you, Sticky Fingers, for bringing positive music for real, for real. And just abstract, like talking about planets, talking about dogs and masters, just like a whole abstract way of being relatable to everybody else. And I appreciate it. So with that being said, it's your boy Jakar. Thank you guys for watching. 
Sticky fingers caress your soul. I'll see you guys.